What's going on guys? Steel here. Doing a video tonight on a custom backspacer I had done for my paramilitary 2. This was done by Johnny Sykes. You can find him over on USN. I just thought it'd be cool to get one. They're really well priced. He does really good work. Um, they're like $25 for a G10 version, if I remember correctly, and the pricing has stayed the same. And then I think $30 for a carbon fiber one, maybe a little more. You'll have to check with him. Um, I personally, like I said, his work is great. I just had him make one and send it to me in the mail. And I think because Paramilitary 2's tolerances aren't, they're high, but not like, you know, a Sebenza or something where they re stay super consistent. It was a little too thick, and so I had to do, I sanded it down a little bit myself. Um, if it was me, I would just send my Paramilitary 2 to him. But I really like that gear pattern. I've been trying to contact Brad Southerd to get one, but I don't believe, um... I don't think he opens his books anymore, so. Oh, I also, I did a video on the heat coloring for Pocket Clip. I actually did it on this flashlight one. I haven't uploaded it yet because um, it was only the third thing I've ever done. So, and I say in the video, you know, there's obviously people who have been pimping things for a while that would be far better to show this sort of thing. So if you guys want me to upload the video, this is what the clip ended up churning out. You can see on the edges there's a little bit of purples and stuff, but for the most part it's a bronze color. Which I still like how it looks versus like a real shiny look. So let me know. It's, uh, to be honest, <laughs> kind of ghetto. <laughs> I just do it at a kitchen stove top. I mean, you can do it with a small torch or whatever. It's just the principle of heating it up. You don't want to overheat it or I think it'll become like this tarnished look like this pair two clip. You know, I almost kind of like how this pair two clip looks though. It still reminds me of like an old tarnished brass casing, gun casing. So so that's how this ended up churning out, guys. I mean, if you want me to upload the video, I will. And you'll at least have an idea of how I'm doing it. I'll also do a review on this lens light. Um, or not lens light, sorry, jet beam. This is a cool little flashlight. So, alright guys, that's it for tonight. Uh, I will put Johnny's um, email address and stuff below the video. Um, and thanks for watching.